Mr. Susan Miller, founder of AstrologyZone.com, is here with her predictions. Let's see what the stars say. Astrologer Susan Miller, founder of AstrologyZone.com, is here with some royal predictions. Those people want her guidance, her insight. She'll just say, oh, did you know this little tidbit about, like, the glyph of Saturn, you know, because, like, it's about a material over spirit and we have a very Saturn life. And I was like, well, that's pretty profound. I remember okay. that. I'm not quite sure what to expect. Since I'm kind of going into the unknown, so we will see. I, I need to hear the feedback. I need to hear what they have to say. I'm here to listen. Susan Miller, who is the guru of astrology, oh, yeah, yeah, is yeah. absolutely fantastic. I'm not a big astrologer well, person. I am. <laughs> Just, I can't wait. Uh, you know, every month, every month I want to read her okay. astrology, and I believe in her. Particularly in October, when Saturn leaves Libra, the housing market will turn its corner, big time. There are many answers one can give. Perhaps the simplest is that astrology is the belief that something born in a moment of time has qualities of that moment of time. My mother knew it, it was quite a scholar. She, she loved astronomy and then her sister got her interested in astrology. She didn't really want to study astrology but her sister said you're better with the math than I am and I need you to do the charts so help me out here. So my mother loves studying all kinds of things, so she said, fine, but I will show you that astrology doesn't work. And that was the initial agreement. <laughs> so she got into it and was amazed at how it works. very quickly you know it only stays in a sign for about two days okay. and so for both of them to have the moon in the same place that's pretty extraordinary that's and ideal it, that's what and you the want. moon is the fine-tuning to your character it's the part that you don't really see in a person until you know them well and when the moons are compatible that's lovely there's a big misconception however about astrology. People who don't study it think that it's about predestination. It has nothing to do with that. You will, in the final analysis, choose the right course of action. And you would probably have several courses of action to choose from, and you would pick the one that feels right for you. I can show you the condition, but in the end, you're the little engine that's going to push this forward. I, I am truly a New Yorker. I always say that my column should help you right this minute. You shouldn't have to wonder about it like some fuzzy blue, you know, communication that you're not even sure what I said. It should be practical, clear, straightforward. It should give you ideas to solve a problem or give you ideas of goals you should be going for right this minute or what good is it.